Hi, welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Legends. When we last left off, we defeated the boss of the June Ruins and got the Red Refractor. Oh, look, cutscene right away. Okay, I'm fresh out of ideas. You know, what bothers me most is that while we're sitting here, he's out there digging up all sorts of stuff. Calm down, Teasel. You're going to burst. He won't beat us to the treasure. No one will as long as that big door is still locked. All we have to do is make sure we get rid of him before then. Right? So what if he digs up a few scraps here and there? He can keep that garbage. All we're after is whatever's behind the main gate. Right, Teasel? You know, you're absolutely right. Then that will be our new plan. We'll wait for him to open the main gate. We'll let him keep whatever he finds until then. He'll see. It'll be the Bonds who have the last lap in this game. That's right! <laughs> Oh, you gotta love the Bonds, they're so hilarious. I, I especially love her teacup there with, with her face on it. At least I, I'm assuming it's a teacup because, remember this is a Japanese game and they don't, they wouldn't be drinking coffee like we do here in the States. So it's just an assumption because one of the surf bots says, mm, this coffee sure is good, and one of the other cutscenes. So. And I do believe this will lead us into another cutscene, so I will probably be shutting up again. I don't believe it, Mega Man. It's a red refractor. With this, we should be able to repair the flutter. Hooray! Let's go, Mega Man. Let's go fix the flutter. Mega Man, could you take care of the refractor? Okay. Finished. It's ready. Okay, I'm all done here too. I'm going to fire up the engine, Mega Man. You grab that blue lever there. Gotcha. This one, right? Yep, on my mark. Ready. Cell switch on. Refractor rotation speed increasing. Engine field generation at 80%. Safety lock, check. Initiating countdown. Three, two, one. Mega Man, now! Here goes. Metastatic field operational. Pair production active. Come on, fly. We're flying! to reach that cave now, too. Let me know when you want to start a dig at the cave, and I'll take you there any time. All right, so we got the flutter fix. This is a flower you gave Roll. She must have really liked it. Charge our energy and save here, so. In case something happens, don't have to do that all over again. So now let's look around the flutter a bit. This is Gramps' room. I think. First aid box. But you don't really need it as long as Data's around. No, no, this is my room. The the rooms I think are set up a little differently here in the first game. clock that Roll gave us. So the last room would be Gramps' room. And 
further in parts of the island, you should expect sunshine, followed in the morning by clouds in the afternoon. You might want to take an umbrella along if you're going to the close of woods. Oh, hi, Mega Man! A meeting I found asked me to find out what the treasure is supposed to be buried here. This island's just so many mysteries, I don't know where to start looking. Mega Man, have you ever heard of the main gate? No. The largest ruin of the island is called the Main Gate, and can be found near the old city. What's unusual about it, as far as anyone knows, there's no way to get inside. I have a theory that it's connected somehow or with the sub-gates. Tell me, Mega Man, have you found a passage in the sub-gates that connects to the Main Gate? No. If I'm right, the sub-gate and closer wards is some kind of key for the Main Gate. I'm willing to bet anything the treasure those pirates are after is inside the main gate. They probably realize how close they and we are getting to the treasure. Don't let your guard down. I know, that was probably the worst Gramps voice ever. There, she's finally fixed. Well, not 100% fixed, but we should be able to get around the island. She'll take us to the other subgates, or the closer woods. Go to the subgate. You want to go to the subgate in Closer Woods? Yes! Up and away! Okay, well, now we're back at, now we're in the, uh, sub-ruins. Let's go look. Just in case you didn't realize, we're actually at the ruins where the pirates were digging, which is why we couldn't make it up here, which is why we had to wait to get to the flutter. I've never seen a site like this before. There's a big pit in the middle, and I can't get any readings from inside. I wonder what could be in there. Let's find out. Mega Man? Are you okay? Can you see a door somewhere? I see two. I can't get any readings of that room, Mega Man. My monitor's completely blank. Take a look around and let me know what you see. I see what looks like a giant computer room. My guess the power's out in that room. Can you see a switch anywhere? I don't see any switches, but there's some writing here. Let's see. It says, Operations Room 2. Emergency system activation requires direct password input from Eden or the insertion of 3 level 2 or higher prototype anthro unit ID cards. What's a prototype anthro unit? I've never heard of that before. Well, whatever that is, you need three ID cards, right? If we're lucky, you'll be able to find them inside there. Yes, here we are with uh, Capcom's golden rule of three. There's the three of something, you know, we just go find one big thing and be done. But that's all right, we'll have some fun in the ruins. There's no response. Looks like the power's off there, too. Maybe you'll be able to find the generator somewhere in there. Well, deeper in we go. Looks like we ain't got a choice. Oh, God. Put him right at the end. Let him have time to spawn. Toro! Toro!
almost repaired all the damage they did to me there. Whoa. Whoops. I just fell off. Those are really good for farming money at the early game. Because there's a specific area you can go to at the second ruin, and you can kill them over and over again, making a couple thousand every time you run in. So at the early game, it's how we got Machine Gun Buster up so quickly. We got a refractor shard. We got 1,840 zenny. We got another refractor shard. 1,200 zenny. Believe me, I'm gonna need all the money I can get here real soon. I, I gotta. I wanna get more of the. I wanna get more of the. Uh, emergency energy tank done, and I got my favorite weapon of the game coming up here, and it is the most expensive. Let's see what's down this way. I'm ignoring you. Uh, looks like it connects to the sub-ruins again. Uh, let's see what's inside. So we're on the other side of the breakable wall in the first ruin. We got an ancient book. For. Can you get it to work? All right! You should be able to get the elevator to work now. All right, so that's been taken care of. Oh, look, a box. And an ID card. Did you find something, Mega Man? I think I found an ID card. Good going. I'll go back to that control room. Once I found the others. You know, with how much dialogue there is in this sequence, it almost makes it feel like that June was just kind of thrown together uh, in preparation for this one. I mean, they needed us to have some to play the flutter with, yeah, but uh, June just wasn't quite as involved. Mega Man barely said anything in the last level. See, that's the way back to the main chamber, so let's see what's down here. Target sensor. That's the item for my favorite one. Let's go up and find out. Ow! I'll put him right in front of the door. I mean, I guess that would be good security, but still, it's... Guidance unit. Uh, I think those are the items I need for my favorite weapon. All the enemies respawn because of, uh... That's right, I'm shooting you through the door. Ah, there's another one. Oh, 
Oh, seem to die a little faster because we're shooting it through the door. Probably just my imagination. Oh, there's a path over here I haven't explored yet. And a hole in the wall. Looks like. And we get another refractor shard. We got 450 zenny. Aww. We get more from killing the enemies. That there was like almost 2,000 zenny. I'm not sure. I, I don't. I can never remember the actual value of each zenny refractor. The only one I know of. Well, I know two of them off the top of my head. Uh, the small blue one is worth 10, and the green ones are worth 50. But that's it. I, I don't remember what the other ones are worth. Turn to the surface. Yes. Alright, roll. Do we have my favorite weapon ready finally? Nope, that's her door. Let me know when you want to go back to Cardon Forest. Go to the R&D room. Item development. Dun -dun. The guidance unit was made to use the active buster. It fires homing missiles that will track the nearest enemy. There's still a lot of enhancements I could make to this. Depending on how you choose to improve it, it could become your most powerful weapon. That's right. Active Buster! Let's enhance it. Alright, we're gonna work on energy because this weapon actually has infinite energy if you can max it out. Ooh, that's almost maximum amount of money, I think. No, no, not quite, not quite. It is, uh, not fully maximum amount. Alright, so I'm going to uh, AFK and I'm going to go and farm money. So when we come back, we'll finish up the ruins and you'll see the fully active buster. So we'll see you then.